The top den Merida. We're now gonna wait. <gasps> oh no, no, no! Merida, 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 move, move, move! Hi guys, and welcome back to the next episode of One Life, and today we are back on the server. Now, last episode, we fought and faced some of the mobs that were added through more creatures. In this episode, we're gonna get some. So, I want to go out into the world and find some mobs that I can tame and call my own and claim as pets and love forever as a fish, not you. So, I have seen a dolphin around here. Some, there he is. Come here, come here, come here. You're mine. Okay, I just need to tame it. <gasps> it works! Okay, so I think I'm going to name all of the animals the first letter of what they are. So this can be Dora the dolphin. Oh my goodness, I have a dolphin. This is everything I've ever wanted. Thank you, Dora. Now, honestly, this is a pretty big lake. The only thing I kind of want to do is I think I'm going to go and grab maybe some glass and then block off either sides so that Dora has her own little enclosure she can swim about into her heart's content. I'll make some reinforced glass that way no one else can break it. Oh, actually, no, I also want to grab some blocks just to make a little bridge. Because I know Callum has been saying about he wanted to build a bridge for ages, but I don't think I want Callum building a bridge. Whereas this way, I can build the bridge, which means I can maintain how cute it is. But also, I've got a place for my dolphin. Not gonna lie, this is deeper than I thought it was going to be. And I don't have enough reinforced glass. I've also put some in the wrong place. Yeah, I'm just gonna need to use dirt for the rest of that and just sort of bring up the floor a little bit. I can't really see, but I think I've filled it in. I think we're good. And then, there we go. A nice little bridge. It kind of covers the reinforced glass so you don't see it as much. And it means that my dolphin is safe to swim about to her heart's content without escaping that way. I already terraformed over there. Don't know what that noise was. Gonna ignore it. And then I need to just block off over there with some dirt. Oh no wait, does that just go into the corner? Because if it does, she can swim over. Oh, it does. Okay, that's it blocked. Perfect. Oh, I think I need to block this off. Because otherwise, I think she can fall into it. And I think it'll cause her to drown or suffocate. Okay, I think we've walled off. I am a little bit worried as I can no longer find Dora, even though she was here a few moments ago. Dora, you better not have left me already. You know what? I'm just going to assume she's somewhere in that lake. It's a nice big open place. She's just somewhere in there, guys. It's fine. Now, one thing I do want to also make is another looting upgrade because looting is what causes mobs to drop stuff. And if I get high looting, it means when I kill like manticores and snakes, they're more likely to drop more eggs. So I want to see about getting that. Also, a bunch of you have been moaning at me because I'm still using an advanced iron sword. A, it's very rare I use a sword. I am normally using my bow for everything. But also, I do eventually want to see about getting a nether star slash advanced nether star sword. So there is no point in me wasting diamonds to to get an advanced diamond sword if I'm then just going to replace it. So everyone get off my back. Okay, so now that's one and I could do with making another set of that, which would then be two. And I just need more gold. I don't have a lot. Do I have enough to make four more blocks? or no three more blocks on top of that which I do not have enough to do you know what looting this is probably gonna do I'll save that other looting for when I eventually get my other sword it's all gonna be great I have looting five which as I said should be more than enough it's going to be night time which is fine because I want to head out into the night to try and find some manticores some scorpions not ogres and not whatever that is manticores no you stay away. It's a good thing I one shot them because when they get angry, they just bop the ground that they're around. Oh, you, you come down here. Come back here. No, stop running away from me. Yes, come on. A couple more. One more. <gasps> it dropped an egg. I have a manticore egg. I need more. I need a manticore army. I know I asked last episode if there was anything in the mod that gave you the ability to fly and a bunch of you said the fairy horses, but they involve a lot of breeding. Oh yes, manticore. There's Mantico. Oh no. Yeah, you can stay away. I don't need the rats thinking they can get up all of my business. Did I ever use my mending? Oh, I can't put mending on my bow. I would need to make another bow and put that on first. That was what it was. You. Yeah, you scare me. You stay away from me. The werewolves, as I said, are the own. No. 
As I'm like, the werewolves are the only things that scare me. A witch runs at me and I'm like, no, no. Yeah, the werewolves scare me because they do not take a lot of damage. Like everything else I can sort of like one shot with my bow. Okay, while it turns daytime, this is a fairly safer area. I'm going to have a quick tab out and have a look at manticores and see how I tame them. Okay, so that apparently I can tame it by either using a medallion, a book, or name tag. Now, I might just use a name tag I feel like that'd be easier. I just want to see if there's like special books in here. It also says it can wear armor. And I also need to make a whip to get it to stay, which is leather, big cat claws, and iron now the only big cat i seen was the tiger that was down here but he seems to have disappeared but i suppose if i make my manticore hatch inside then it doesn't matter because he can only wander around my house so i think we're gonna go back we're gonna go and place our manticore egg down let that hatch oh there's a turkey oh there's two i'm sorry Merry Thanksgiving. I'm also still slightly worried about Dora, but she's fine. Dora's out there somewhere, I swear. If anyone sees Dora in anyone else's video, let me know. So then it's a manticore, so I'm gonna name it Merida. So I think I'll maybe just put Merida down here at the moment because I can eventually now progress the tunnel onward to have more pets. But at the moment, I don't have that. So we've popped in Merida. We're now gonna wait. <gasps> oh no, no, no! Merida, 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 move, move, move! Oh god. Oh my goodness, what just happened to Merida? Hello? Merida lost almost all her hearts for no apparent reason. Does a splash potion heal her or hurt her? I'm scared to try it. Merida, Jesus. That's not what I needed. I'm gonna try the spring water. Pop it on little Merida, which does give her regen. Thank goodness. Oh, that was traumatizing! So there's that on Merida. You stay here. Now it says they can take a few in-game days to grow up. So that's fine. I can wait a few days because now I can go out in search of other animals. Now I know if I kill snakes, I get eggs. Scorpions, sometimes if they have babies on their back, you can get their babies. And horses, I need to do lots of taming, which we're not doing this episode. <gasps> Is that Dora? Dora, you're not Dora. You can be Daphne. Daphne, I've trapped you in ice. Just love me already. Daphne, you can't go anywhere. Dora was a lot more friendly than you are. Have we come to an agreement that you love me? No, we haven't. No, love me. You're stuck in a little river. You can't really go anywhere. Even if you did try to suffocate me in a wall. Oh my goodness. Why are you such a problem, child? Daphne, come up here so I can surround you in ice. Daphne. I can hold my breath for a long time, hun. Not as long as you, but pretty long. Why won't it tame? Like, if I kill you, do you give me raw fish? You gave me nothing now, I just feel bad. Okay, we're on the... No, we were so close. We're on the dolphin. We're on the dolphin. Thank goodness. Okay, Daphne. Thank you, finally. Now, can you make it across land? Just this little bit. No, you can't. I believe in you. You can make it. There we go, Daphne. I told you you could. That's not animal cruelty. No one tell Peter. So welcome to your big lake. This is a giant duck that is for you. You have fun, Daphne. Dora's in there somewhere. You be friends. Okay, there's an ostrich. Which, you don't kill ostriches to get eggs. You have to, like, steal them. And when you do that, the parents will attack you. But also, you're a male ostrich. So you're not going to help in this situation. Oh, you're a mouse. You're cute. Hehe. <laughs> Okay, although the mouse is really cute, and I will eventually probably get one, do not need one today. But I can get two and call one Mickey and one Minnie. Oh my goodness, I'm so smart. I'm the, totally the first person to ever think of that. What on earth is this? Oh, I'm, I very nearly was not paying attention to the fact that I was crossing a giant ravine. Jesus. I'm just thinking savannas might be a good place. And I know there is one way over here. But there's also an open field here, which also might be a good thing. It's like I'm not going out for a specific pet at the moment. But let me know in the comment section down below if there is a specific animal I should be trying to get. Now I know manticores will be good because you can ride them. And they're one of the fastest like mounts in mole creatures. So like that's a good one to have because I can fly and I can run and I'll be cute. But I know that there are other animals which are cuter. But just never tell Merida I said that. She doesn't quite have the self-esteem for it. Okay, I've actually not seen any more creatures. 
just sheep, which is nice and all, but I can't ride a sheep into battle. So, not really the type of animal I'm looking for here. I mean, this rate I've almost run all the way to the Mesa, which again was a biome that I think will have things. Did not necessarily want to go this far, but here we are. I have done it now. That's so strange. There is a singular villager house with a bed, a work table. That's so strange. Why? Ah yes, I have returned Mesa. Give me all of your mo creatures. Oh, the Deadlands thing's normally good for snakes. <gasps> There's a snake. I'm sorry. <gasps> you dropped two eggs. Cobra snake eggs. Perfect. There's already eggs here from something. Dark snake eggs. Oh, we got a python egg. It is becoming spooky night time. And out here is probably not the best place to be. So I should probably see about getting my bed down. We also did get an orange snake egg. Okay, I have cobra, orange, python, and dark. Now, I'm definitely not going to be hatching the snakes today because I kind of want to make like a snake enclosure. Oh, I don't have one of those lime green ones. Give me your baby. You did. I suppose if I just murder them all and then I could always trade people snake eggs. Because I mean, that's something someone definitely probably wants, maybe. Oh, this is also where I might find an ostrich egg because they'll leave them in the sand. You're massive. I mean, you're dead now, but you were massive. There's a baby elephant! Oh my god. How do I tame baby elephants? 10 sugar lumps or 5 cakes. I do not have either of those things. But there are some sugar over there. That's only 8 sugar lumps. I need 10. That would be 10. Come here, come here, come here. Oh, no wait, sugar lumps a thing? Dang it. Which is 4 sugar and it doesn't even work in your own inventory. I mean, I, I can't tame you then. I'm sorry, bub. I see no ostriches to steal their babies from, which upsets me. What's that? Why is there a log? That's strange. Why are you like that? Hmm, nothing this way. I'm maybe going to head back towards the mesa and have a look on that side. Because I've got a lot of snake eggs and I have my manticore, which I just need to wait till it grows up. But I could do with like an ostrich egg or literally anything. Okay, there's an ostrich, but I don't see an egg. There's a mummy ostrich. Do you have an egg? No. Why? Where's your egg? What is that? It seems like a weird dungeon temple, but it also kind of seems like it's been broken into already. Yeah, this has already been invaded. Interesting. It seems like there would have been like redstone traps and such. Right, well, I got a bunch of snake eggs, which again, not ideal, but better than nothing. So I think I'm just going to start making my way back home and then hopefully Merida will be closer to growing up. I'm also going to need to be super careful in Merida because if I accidentally am flying and press control, it's all over. Flying is going to be fantastic and also terrifying. Much easier when I'm able to ride her and also have an elytra. Having an elytra is going to save me. No, I'll take the mouse. Mouse, come here. Mo mouse, thank you. I've got the mouse who will love living with me. It will be great. We will be best friends. There's Daphne. Still no sign of Dora. And then at the moment, we'll put the mouse in the chest room. Because this is a safe spot. You can't really do too much running around. I say that as you climb up into the corner. Right, we're going to change that name tag from Merida to nothing. Because I do not have the experience to do so. So at the moment, you're just going to be a mouse in my chest room. Enjoy that. And then next episode, I think we can start extending our tunnels down again and putting in like a snake room because I have all those eggs. Let me know if there's anyone else you think of that could use an egg that would like a snake egg. I don't know. It's not really the most pet that everyone wants. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode of One Life. If you did, remember to leave a like. Comment down below what other animals you think I definitely need to tame. Having the manticore is going to be very helpful, especially for getting out into the world and finding other things. Remember to subscribe if you're new to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you do not miss a video and I will see you all next time. Merida just got a little bit bigger. Bye!